Welcome to this just a gesture. Um, here we are back again with a another update video week. I, as I said, wanted to keep these things on the ball, continuously moving. You have my reaction videos to the Resident Evil, and I understand that the smartest thing to do is to put them out as fast as you possibly can, but um, they're my unique reactions. They're how I feel, and if if you truly are coming in and you're watching and you wanting to see how I'm reacting, which <laughs> I will say that I did mess up. Um, so I've got one monitor over here, one monitor over here, and as you're seeing, you here. I messed up and put it on this monitor right here, so this is the way that everyone got to see my face. I, there are some parts of the reaction that are decent, but the majority of them kind of fell through the cracks. Went to a whole bag of suck. But that's on me, and that is something that I'm going to eventually have to learn to get better at um the biggest thing that i want to just talk about which if i can i want to start cutting my update videos down as low as i possibly can mondays are going to be reserved for the monday video for these update videos and uh they're going to be getting closer and closer till they are at uh I think 11 o'clock is going to be the cutoff point, just because of the fact that it is super late at night for me. Um, uh, it won't be the time that I will have recorded this, but it is around the time that I would be up and I'd be moving and I could take a look at this and... I can comment, I can do this, I can do that, because I'm up around that time, and more than likely, if I am streaming, then you watch, you would end up possibly uh, getting notification on Twitter, um, which I do need to pop that into the link on my back half of my YouTube channel, so, or you can actually check the link in the description just below. Um, I've got just about every single link that you could possibly need every link that you could possibly need from that then that i mean really outside of talking about all that the only thing else left to do is talk about how last week i moved from five to six this week is going to be from a six to a seven this video will land at six o'clock and then every video after will be at a seven o'clock time frame where when I get to later dates, I can do more. I, I still kind of want to do all my video games the way that I'm doing it. And it is to... Because I love all types of video games. And I know that over the years, so many people have grown to this. You... um. Hey, you like this type of game, or hey, you, you're this type of gamer and everything. I've played PC games. Played them when I was in high school. I did not have a PC. I didn't have a PC until the time that I'm at the age right now. And it's not the fact that I didn't want it. It's just the fact that my parents could not afford something like that. I really just now started getting the kind of equipment to be able to start doing this kind of unique stuff at the precipice of where my life is right now i don't know if i actually said it in a way that it should be said but that's where i'm coming from that's what i'm trying to talk about um i don't see gaming as being either independent game or triple a titles i see games as coming together and losing yourself in a story that was created to give an 
entertaining structure to people. I've I was given at a young age from my parents because they could not be around a lot of the time because they were working and they were gone most of the time which is quite funny because that's kind of where I'm at at the moment I'm gone most of the time and at the current time it's late at night really late at night of course it's currently on the weekend for me so when you're watching this Monday I'm just back into the groove of things getting some stuff done whatever blah 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 you know just getting my regular life on but my parents first gave me my first system as a way to have something to do while they were at work when I was home by myself or I was home babysitter and it was through that that I grew to love video games they were to me and everyone has their own independent story everyone does which is the reason why I do have a definition to myself what I believe a gamer is a gamer that just loves all types of games there's been so many times that I have said my brother-in-law and to my son and to my wife that there's not really much video games out there that I'm looking forward to there's not really much out there at all and just where are video games going then I get slapped in the face because of the fact that the way that I love video games so much I will look at a video game and I'm like this is interesting this looks interesting and eventually I end up buying it eventually I end up playing so many video games that I end up growing a very big collection you got your people that grow a collection of books which I'm lightly doing that too because I just don't want to play video games. I love reading comics stuff like that anyways um but that's where the discussion I kind of landed for this video was just the fact that I don't want to be tied down specifically to one genre and I'm sure that there will be a couple of genres that I stick to because of the fact that they have the most longest running story arcs convoluted and just scatterbrained to the point that does it really connect? Yeah. But storyline nonetheless that I have fallen in love with this series and continued to go. Uh, most people know the very big one for me, which is uh, Resident Evil, close friends and whatnot. Which, yes, yeah, I haven't put much of anything except from old uh, attempts and whatnot, which... kind of want to go through and uh, delete those and I'm pretty sure that I will just to um, redo it put my all in it and just really have fun with the game that's a lot of the things that I was messing up when doing this kind of stuff I didn't have fun with the games anyways as I continue to do these and these don't get watched for very long I want to say thank anyone that has happened to and or possibly will end up happening to stay this long in the video thank you so much and uh, continue to check out my content maybe like and subscribe to continue to follow letting me know in the comments below if there's anything that I could possibly do a little bit better. I'm sure I ramble on. I'm. Just, I mean, I'm down for the constructive criticism that could make me a wee bit better. And yes, before you say that, I do understand the mic situation. I have done everything I can with this. It will cut in and out depending on how 
high volume and I've put multiple things into the thing, it like it's showing me that it's picking up everything. But when I go to listen to it, some of my audio really cuts out. And I don't know if it's the fact that it's this because this is brand new or if it's my computer, which I constantly will continue to think it's that and till I can eventually dock out computer. I've got a couple pieces to that. I'm working on getting more. Um, any which way, I'm going to leave it at that. Y'all have a great late rest of y'all night. Check out some more of my videos on my YouTube channel and or go to my stream, which is on the back half of my YouTube channel on twitch.tv and check to see whether or not I might actually be up there or take a look at Twitter and I might actually be talking. Until next time. Deuces.